Hey there, so we're going to configure SNMP v3 on our column manager. So we're going to go over into serviceability on your column manager publisher, and we'll go into the SNMP, go into the v3 menu, and pick the user option. Go ahead and click the find button, and now we'll click add new to add a new entry. Type in the username that you'd like to use for this v3 entry. We're also going to configure an authentication password as well as a privacy password. I'll note that the protocol for both authentication uh, and privacy is limited to SHA and AES-128. Uh, so you, when you click those drop downs, uh, you'll see that those are the only two things you can pick. Uh, we'll go ahead and select those. Now, I want to put in a specific IP address of our nine line agent uh, to restrict access to this SNMPv3 user account. So we'll go ahead and put in the IP address of the nine line agent here, click insert. And then we're going to pick our privileges. Uh, we only need read-only access, so we'll go ahead and select that. If you have multiple nodes in your cluster, you would click Apply to All Nodes. It's going to save you a step from having to uh, go and configure on each of the nodes individually. Uh, once you've clicked that and saved it, it's going to restart the SNMP services on all the nodes. And now when we get the restart successful and add successful messages, we know that we can now use the SNMPv3 config. Thanks.